Mike Servan uses the name Jesus Christ against the devil. Jesus Christ! Well, how did you feel when people called you crazy? Talk to me a little bit about that. Jesus Christ. When people call me crazy, it made me go more crazy. Because when I would tell them what I was seeing, what I was hearing, what I was telling them, they were saying, you're hearing things, you're seeing things. You're going crazy. And in my mind, I was like, but it's real to me. It's real to me. So I never gave them, I, I, I never gave the foothold of me thinking that I was crazy because I knew it was real to me. How do you explain when like someone says, hey man, I saw something like lurk up in the shadows in a, in a very, in a very unhuman way. Yeah. And then like, what do you do then as a psychologist? Oh, you're just delusional. And I think by discrediting people, you know what I mean? We're suppressing the truth of this spiritual warfare that we're in. And um, you say the name Jesus Christ boldly confidently and and how do you like talk to people that um feel discredited what would you tell them and uh tell them how you fight your battles by saying the name jesus christ and why that name is so important on your lips and in your heart jesus christ so what i will tell people when they're seeing things hearing things fighting things I would tell them it's real I would never never hold the truth away from them and tell them a lie that it's not real because if you tell them a lie it's not real they live in that lie of thinking it's not real so they don't know what's going on it's real and when you acknowledge something is real what happens when you really know something's going on you know what's going on and you tell them it's demons because nobody's going to tell somebody it's demons. A lot of people won't say demons. A lot of people won't say the devil. The Christian community will. but And there's only a few of us. But the world won't. The world won't. And, and, and I, can, I, I can almost promise you this. That people out there in the streets fighting them demons. They're hearing more that it's fake than that it is real. And, 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 and the proof is in the pudding. That's why they stay like that. Because when they feel like they're crazy, they feel like they have no help. But when they, when they know that it is real and it's demons, they got the help from Jesus. And for me, the way I acknowledge that it was real is that nobody, no, nobody told me this. Everybody was telling me I was crazy. Everybody was telling me I was saying things. But God told me. God told me. When I started thinking it was aliens and everything, God got a hold of me and says, Not nah, Mike. It's like those are demons. Those are demons. Hey guys, if you like that clip, hit that like button, share, and subscribe for more content through Minutes with God Community Network. Thank you and God bless.